Okay, so, uh, yeah, I just had to tell uh, uh, all my social media, all that kind of stuff to check this out because we need to check this out, guys. So, we, we were up to eight views currently on it, and I know we will get more, like, as I post it out, but that was a little weird five minutes going on, so I hope it kind of turns around here. I'm feeling it. I really am. All right, so... Next, I will give you my ML. Uh, this is a new kind of thing I've done on it, too. It's Ben's top 10 MLB teams week one of it. Now, I know we all have different opinions, and I know it's not week one, but this is how I personally think it is. Number one, the New York Yankees with an eight-game winning streak, with a 26-10 and 10 record. They have been balling out. Had questions about them. You know, it still is the beginning of the season, but the first week, first two two weeks of the season, and they've really been doing great now. So they, they, they've really improved. And number two, it still isn't the Boston, excuse me, it still isn't the Boston Red Sox. It's actually the Houston Astros at number two with a 24 and 15 record, a three game winning streak. And then number three comes the Boston Red Sox, but we're a number one team for a while. With a 25 and 11 record, they've lost three of their last four games. And then number four is the Atlanta Braves with a 21 and 14 record. Very impressive for them. Two game win streak. Five is the D backs here as they are at 24 and 12. Six is Mike Trout and the Angels at 22 and 14. And then number seven, the Philadelphia Phillies at 22 and 15. Eight, Pittsburgh Pirates at 21 and 16 and then nine yes the Milwaukee Brewers with 21 and 16 and then number 10 the Rockies at 21 and 16 as you see it's all so close so next week no none of the teams could be in the top 10 do I think that happened probably not but no that's that's how it is right now so yeah so yes I did my first half of it and I will give you guys my picks for tonight's game between the Predators or the Jets at Predators Game 7, the conference semifinals, huge game for that. But some sports news just real quick all across it. As the Hornets have reached a four-year deal with new coach James Barreto as he, for NBA. That's for NBA. The Charlotte Hornets have done that. So then the Cavs are the favorite to win this series. I saw on ESPN versus the Celtics. So they are the favorites because now the Celtics are the underdogs here. Even though the Cavs don't have home court advantage and Boston does. And then you guys saw my title as you're seeing this video is Blake Burles is the GOAT. He is! He is a superhero, guys. Blake Burles is a superhero. He helps a would-be thief until the police arrive and... He's not only good on the field. I think he showed up in the playoffs. That guy balled out. He's a superhero off the field. Put that cape on Blake Bortles and call him Superman. I salute my hat to you, Blake Bortles. I've all... Uh, you got my respect. And then for tonight's game, I have the Predators winning. And yeah, that's how I see it coming. I think the... I'm just going to say they're going to win. I don't want to get... Too confident with my game-by-game -game predictions and saying what the exact score is, but yeah. So now for the next minute or two, you guys will be commenting questions. And yeah, and then I'll go then. So yeah, uh, you guys, as you comment your questions, I'll check on my iPad mini. And, um... Let me check... So, also, I do have some huge announcements as tomorrow I will be predicting, well, tomorrow, so much actually stuff going on with Ben Sports. I have, well, on my main channel here, it won't be live, but I am going to predict the NBA Conference Finals. Um, predicting the Conference Finals. Oh. And, yeah. See, uh, oh, wrong one. Yo, I'm not seeing any questions anyway, so it probably doesn't matter. But anyway, um, my vlog is tomorrow, and then I'll be predicting the conference finals with a special guest. 
I'm not going to say it because I don't want to reveal anything. But uh, he's been on here before. And I'll say that he's not a new guest. And then um, tomorrow's my vlog. I think you guys are going to like it. I had to do a cringy one since the other one didn't get 10 likes. So you guys will get a room of this one, a tour of this room. But honestly, I probably won't even do a tour room of this one because you guys have seen in so many videos different angles of this room. So honestly, the pack room tour is probably it for that. But yeah, I got some likes, not 10, so I had to do a cringy one for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy that tomorrow. That'll be a lot of fun. And yeah, since I see no questions, I think we will go out on that note. Oh, and also, remember to tune in on Monday. I want to see more viewers. You guys, come on. I know we all have our off days, but... Jeez, woof, getting this amount. But anyway, I want to keep positive vibes going. So I hope you guys... Have, as I even lost a viewer. Anyway, I hope you guys have an amazing day. I do. And until then, I'll see you guys on Monday, right here, same place, same time. Maybe I was a little late. Maybe that's why. I promise I won't be late this time. Check out my new content on my main channel tomorrow, on my vlog channel tomorrow. Bunch of Ben Sports. Gotta get those views up, guys. I know you will. We all have our off days. Bye.